Hey boys and girls, um, this is Miss Shoemaker. I um, just want to check in with everybody and read you a really quick book real fast. Um, since the weather has been a little groggy again, it's been raining a lot here lately, so I thought it'd be perfect to read the book, How Does the Rain Fall? The Story of a Little Raindrop. And don't forget when you're reading your stories, don't forget to go over with your parents. Tell them this is the front cover of the book and the back cover. And don't forget the spine. All right, here we go. Some water from the ocean has turned into vapor. The vapor has risen into the air and formed a cloud. The sun's heat makes the water turn into vapor. A cloud is made up of many water droplets. As they bump into each other, they get bigger and form raindrops. The wind is blowing the cloud across the sky. The cloud changes color to gray as it fills up with more raindrops. The cloud is getting heavy now as more raindrops form inside of it. The sun is shining brightly it has been a hot day. Warm air is rising from the earth. The warm air bumps into the cloud and a thunderstorm forms. Lightning zigzags across the sky. Some of the heavier raindrops fall from the cloud. The rain stops, the sky clears, the sun is shining. All right, that is our story for the day. Um, I hope that you can take the time, if it is okay with your parents, to maybe go outside once it's done raining, maybe put your rain boots on, go jump in some puddles. Um, maybe you could even find um, a big puddle and see if you could see um, and find something in your house that maybe could sink or float. Remember, sink means that it's gonna go under the water. Float means that it's going to stay above the water. Maybe if you have a toy boat or something, some kind of toy in your house that you could play with that would be really fun to go outside and do that. Hope everybody has a great day. Hope to see you soon. Bye.